What is going on, guys? We are back with another video today, and it's the NFL Draft. Some of the most exciting times in the NFL. Some would say even the most exciting time. And a crazy shocker at number one. The Cincinnati Bengals have taken the one-year man. To be fair, with the way you explain it, it does kind of sound shocking. But Joe Burrow, a 23-year-old one-year wonder uh, out of LSU. Going to be, uh, he's a bit on the older side, though. He's 23, heading on to 24 years old, which is, for a QB, that's not obviously huge. But at the same time, I mean, it is an old start. It's it's fine, though. It's fine. You know, it's fine. Uh, the big problem is, with that age, the Bengals roster is still very woesome. That offensive line, good luck to him. Um, he's still relatively clean, especially in a one-year uh, situation. But... The uh, one-year starting situation, anyways. But that receiving group, you got A.J. Green, who's been injury-prone as of late. They do not have a lot of talent. They obviously have still some draft picks left to go, uh, and they might even trade up, but I doubt it. Could see a wide receiver around two. Lots of needs. The defense is a big one, obviously, but for offensive-wise, Joe Burrow is not stepping into a great situation. I don't think it's going to be as bad as some of the other guys like uh, Josh Rosen, perhaps, but... That division can hit. That division isn't, you know, it's it's a pretty ruthless division. You know, if he was joining, like, the AFC East, fair enough. You know, it's not going to be that much of a pounding. But the AFC North is a bit of a challenge, uh, specifically uh, toughness-wise. I think he has what it takes, but it's going to be several seasons before we see anything crazy. I don't think, obviously, he has a chance to sit behind anyone uh, unless some crazy free agent signing happens soon. I think he probably should because, once again, their roster is nowhere near ready. If he can get the Bengals to even eight wins, I would be absolutely shocked. But obviously, speaking of shocked, not at all with this one. The clear cut, I know uh, there was some trade-up rumors, but obviously there's no way the Bengals were going to ever, like, ever trade that uh, that pick. They had to go Joe Burrow, and uh, it looks like they got their QB for the future, the long, long-term future. Andy Dalton is who? Who is that? <laughs> Andrew what? Uh, but of course, if you guys want to hear more draft stuff, I think it's probably just going to be shockers, which you know could be a you know trade where someone moves from 10 to 5 and it involves a really you know big name player. Or we see a shocking draft pick where number two isn't Chase Young, it's to a tag of a low or something. I know that's been you know tinkered with, but it's a little far-fetched in my opinion, but you never know. And then, of course, like I said, the Packers are the next pick. So you're going to see, unless the Packers trade down, probably one more video for the draft for me today, guaranteed. Maybe more we'll see. And then tomorrow we'll have a rebuild with the probably biggest shocker of tonight or just you know a QB going somewhere we haven't made a rebuild on. Maybe all the rebuilds we've done have already predicted it and we have nothing to build. But yeah, Joe Burrow, number one. Welcome to hell, I suppose. Anyways, you know, till next video. See ya!